why linking our moods to our motivation can be detrimental to our progress when you wake up in the morning how good is your mood do you feel energized active and fresh or do you feel flat during the day how does your mood go do your motivation levels fluctuate have you noticed how your emotions go up and down throughout the day because of how things are happening around you understanding our emotional response to the events in our life is very important if we get triggered often cannot manage our thoughts and give in to the never ending negative thought process we become deflated sad angry and frustrated this has become a common problem amongst many of us now remember the days when you were super happy and excited everyone and everything seemed to be in your favor why do you think that's the case an example of a good day is our birthday we feel special and excited and happy we expect everyone to be our well wishers and even if someone doesn't wish us we still pray for them our moods have a lot to do with our motivation and how we live our life what if we weren't so dependent on our moods and how everything around us was going an important thing to re- understand is the concept of i and our when we say our thoughts and i our emotions they are just part of us our moods thoughts and emotions neither define us nor can control us the fact is that we use our thoughts and emotions we are bigger than our mood our thoughts and our feelings we have the power to change them whenever we want most of us have lived a life where our moods and emotions have driven how we think and act don't you think it is time to change would you like to live a li- live today differently what if you force yourself to dress up nicely even though you didn't feel like it what if you could force yourself to smile and remember cherished memories when you were feeling sad what if you could force a laugh and think happy thoughts when you are angry or frustrated we have a choice and a power to do what we want we control our thoughts and can use our emotions to live a life of happiness and prosperity all we need is determination and consistent practice how do we start practice gratitude let's be thankful for everything we have in life practice meditation and mindfulness to remain relaxed and calm during stressful situations practice thinking your thoughts are you ready to control them practice feeling happy and forcing yourself to think and act positively I believe that everyone can live a life of limitless possibilities. I'm thankful to God and the universal energy that guides me every day to share this message.